Chase and we're here at d, &D RV Center in Helena, Montana and today we're going to look at the Sunseeker 2860 DS. Now Sunseeker is the number one selling Class C in America and I'm going to show you why. So up front here you'll have a one piece fiberglass cap. The benefit to a one piece seamless fiberglass front cap is you don't have any possibilities of leaks. This is the first place on a Class C that wants the leaks. You know you're going to be sealed up tight with this cap. Now this is on a Ford F450 Super Duty chassis with the trusted V10 Triton. You have 305 horsepower and 420 foot-pounds of torque. Aluminum rims, extended heated mirrors, uh, nice fiberglass running boards here. <clears throat> now on this model, You'll have an Onan 4000 generator, runs off your gasoline. What's kind of nice is if you get below a quarter tank on your actual coach, this generator will shut off so you don't run out of uh, fuel while you're running it in the campsite. Lots of storage on this coach. Compartment there. Compartment here. Plenty of storage. Now you will have two slides on this coach with slide out awning, makes it nice for rolling off debris, you don't have to get up there and clean your roof. Hot water heater, uh, black tank flush here, outside shower, you're on dual wheels, with your gasoline fill. Now in this compartment here, you have your water work center, or excuse me, not your water work center, but your dump station. All heated and closed, runs up through your bottom here, your tank dumps are here, it has one of these smart valves on it. You unhook it, unlatch it, and then you unscrew it and take it off. Uh, 30 amp cord. 30 amp hookup, city water, TV connection. This is a nice big compartment in here. This actually runs all the way through to the other side. On your rear, LED lighting, nice turn signal lighting, beefy bumper, 7,500 pound rated rit hitch. So you know you're about to tow your car or your boat or the side by side to the lake or wherever you might go. Spare tire underneath here, rear roof ladder, rear backup camera. Now what's really nice on these coaches, you have a backup camera and you have two side cameras. So on each side of the coach, when you flip your blinker on, right or left, you have a camera that comes down on the side so you can see your corners. You don't curb nothing or you can see your trailer as you're turning. On to the main side, your other side of your storage compartment. Now this is a rack and I'll show you what that's for here in a minute. And you have a really nice outside kitchen. Refrigerator, TV, outside sink, a little bit of storage. Now, you actually will have a propane grill on this coach. That is a compartment for your uh, water center, all heated and closed, water filtration system and everything. But I want to talk about the outside grill just a sec. This rack will fold out and your grill is actually inside. You set it on that rack and your propane disconnect is here. So you hook up the grill. You still be able to cook outside. You don't have to cook inside and stink up the coach or, or whatnot. When you're done, you can put everything back in your compartment. Now, also in this uh, compartment here, you have these air hookups for your air ride on the on the rear. You have two air bags by Firestone on the rear of this coach. Helps with. Uh, um, suspension going down the road, it makes a ride better, and when you're towing something, you get load leveling. A nice big 12 volt awning with speakers integrated and an LED light strip. Turn the LED light strip on. One chan hookups out here. Plug in your radio or whatever you might have. Zamp solar port, plug and play, lay out your panel, keep your batteries charged. Again, lots of storage, more storage here. And then your propane tank is here. Fill it up on board the coach.
And there's your camera I was talking about. Same thing on the other side. Flip your blinker on, you got a nice view of the whole side of the coach. Now, <clears throat> this coach will have a one-piece fiberglass roof. So I want to get up there and I want to show you a couple things about this Sunseeker. All right, we're on top of your Sunseeker 2860. And like I said earlier, you'll have a one-piece fiberglass roof. It's not a rubber roof. It's tear resistant. If you do accidentally swipe a tree or something, you don't have to worry about this roof ever tearing. It's seamless. It's easy maintenance. It's very, very nice. It's far superior to a rubber roof. Now, you also have a sewer vent here. So this is connected directly to your black tank. What it does is vents the black tank out, kind of like in your house. That way you don't have to use chemicals if it ever starts to smell. It won't smell because of that vent. And then you also have max air vents. They're really, really nice. If it does hail or you leave them open, that actual particular vent that goes over top your existing one uh, will prevent the uh, lid from getting cracked or rain if you leave it open or getting blown off. So let's head back down. Now before we go inside, I want to talk about the full body paint. This coach will come with full body paint and it's absolutely beautiful. You won't have the graphics that peel on there and after five or ten years of being in the sun, they crack and fade and peel off. This will last you a long time and again, it's absolutely beautiful. Let's head inside and take a look what the interior has to offer. All right, so inside your Sunseeker 2860, you have this nice cab over bunk. This is a really big bed to sleep the kiddos or whoever might be with you. This extra piece here just slides down. And you got a little net here that buckles on each side, that way you can keep anybody from rolling off. Or another great thing to use it for is storage. Again, this net will keep anything from sliding off. You have a nice swivel TV here. And this cab is very comfortable. All your uh, instruments are right here in front of you. AC, heat, and everything. And you also have a touchscreen Pioneer deck here. Now the cameras I talked about earlier, once you turn your blinker on, look at that. You can see the whole side of the coach turning, whatever might be on the side. What a great feature. Cup holders are all right here. Everything's accessible. Now, both these chairs also will swivel. Pull this lever and they swivel around. So you got extra seating. On the side here, you'll have a dinette that makes into a bed very easily. All you do is flip a lever below and push it down. Push it all the way down, readjust your cushions. You have an extra bed. You have two nice cup holders here, so while you're traveling, uh, your co-travelers can put their drinks there and it doesn't slide off the table. You got seat belts in both these uh, seats here. And you have a nice sofa, also with seat, belt, seat belts. But this is a jackknife sofa that also reclines. You don't see that very often. Usually you see just the jackknife. You can sit and ride very comfortably. Under your kitchen, you have lots of storage overhead. A microwave. And three burner stove here with a nice glass cover over the top. Oven. Sink with a countertop cover. Nice big stainless steel sink. Residential style faucet too. Gives you some more prep space. Again, lots of storage above. A little light here to help you see. Nice big refrigerator, gas or electric. And this is one of my favorite features. This great slide out pantry. You're gonna be able to put a lot of stuff in there, and tuck it away, and not sacrifice anything else or room or things like that. Nice big drawer below. And this door, when you get ready to come into the bedroom, closes. And opens real simple real, real simple not a cheap curtain here that slides across and look at this hinge shows you the quality that Forest River puts into their sun seat 
nice shower. And the skylight, give you a little extra room. Lots of storage in the bedroom. Really nice closet, some deep big drawers. You even have another TV in here. Again, another uh, closet. And a really comfortable Cerna mattress. Again, a lot of manufacturers put really cheap mattresses. Sunseeker puts nice mattress. You even have storage underneath the bed. With easy access drawers. You don't have to worry about lifting them up and fighting with it. Now onto your bathroom, right behind you here. Nice bathroom. Porcelain toilet, lots of storage up above here. Medicine cabinet. Nice countertop here with even another counter extension. So if the wife's doing makeup or whatnot, you got lots of counter space. Nice big sink. Again, these are only some of the great features of, on the Sunseeker 2860. You ought to stop by and I'll show you in person. I'm Chase. We're, we're, we're here at D&D RV Center where we make buying easy. Thanks for watching.